Hello guys, welcome back in Integrative Studio and thanks so much for watching this video again and this is, uh, if I, I don't think so, I should uh, say that again. It's a new video, yeah, it's a new video, okay, however, so a few months ago, I uploaded a video about the Unreal Engine uh, Vehicle Drift and Skydmask system with the free projects and which is the UE5 version, so I... After that few months, uh, I just uh, mystically delete that files from the server. So yeah, that's why I rebuilding this one, and also I changed the engine version as well. So currently, I build it on Unreal Engine 5.1.1. So if you are using 5.2 or 5.3 as well, it's going to be work because that uh, video, which is this one, the previous one that I made at in Unreal Engine 5.3 uh, version. So at that time, the which is the user of 5.2 or 5.1, they can't use that project. So that's why I make now in the older version so you can even use in the last version as well. And also lots of you ask me about the password, password, password. So but just guys you can visit our uh, the group of you know the Tech Dev Studio uh, Discord channel and there are also people become crazy. They said they're still asking me about the uploading file, you know this project file where they find. And also guys look. For password, you can go to our announcement and here you can scroll it, okay? Like here I always give the everything. So maybe it's because I regularly post lots of things, that's why it can be go down or uh, up. As you can see at here on the this uh, time, you find the zip password of thank you to our studio. This is the basically the password of the Android SDK even and of the uh, zip also. So you can check them in our announcement, just scroll it, go up and down. Okay, you will be must find the video, uh, the password, and also you can check our Learn Unreal Engine app, which is available in Google Play Store. From here, you can also directly download by uh, Google Drive or Mega Link. Okay, there's a uh, everything pretty much here. It's our official app. You can check it. Okay, right? Yeah. Okay, so let's get started. So I already rebuilt everything with Unreal Engine 5.1. So first, let me give you some overview, and also let me I forget to set up the game maps and more. So you find basically the TDS map and the Unreal Engine vehicle uh, TDS map. Okay, yeah, this thing. So whenever you open this thing, you find this uh, simple uh, level, and if you go to the basically the TDS Quite Mask system, you find the FX that all the smoking particles and the icons. You find all the source icons. And if you go to vehicle slash blueprint slash podcast slash podcast on BP here, it's already have everything ready made pretty sim uh, system and decal and everything. So now here's your vehicle basically. So whenever you now have a decent speed, it's more than 70 or 80 km speed. Then if you back press and uh, try to slide and that point the uh, particle of the smoke will worry a drift system will be work and also it will be uh, give a decal uh, on the present at here also I see that there's a simple little bugs or uh, the issue that is overlapping my car as well so I'm going to be fixed and after a few seconds it's going to be basically high okay so something like this when you have a decent speed and if you left or right with a back space so you mean you know you're trying to drift at that point it will be show you the effect it's pretty good and speeds which look awesome okay so you can use it and it's mobile optimized as well so if you are thinking about to use in a mobile so yeah you can use it okay so yeah that is the thing so let me fix about this thing and how i did and i'm not going to show you the full explain video but i'm going to show you some basic steps so this is this uh part of particle or the vfx so i'm just uh, making a note at say vfx and this is basically the logic scrolling system where it's basically calculating the speed. So I'm giving it the speed uh, CLC. So it's basically calculate the speed. That's why what the heck what I write uh, speed, speed CL, CLC. Okay. So something like this. Okay. That is basically this, this lines of code. It's basically using nothing else. Okay. So it's have the basically all the logic. So at here the spawn size. So we can select here the spawn size. So let me promote a variable. So I can control them both in a same place. And let's set it the height. Basically we need to control with the height one. So I'm just putting it to 20. Let's see how it's work. So you can adjust the uh, size from here. Okay, pretty it's looking like it should working. Uh, this thing is still uh, applying. Hmm. At this time, let's increase the y axis to 20. Let's see if it affects anyhow. Hmm. 
Hmm. I guess I got it because the reason is this one is okay because I said the spawner so they are basically have a two spawner location so let's bring them to some town I guess it should be work more perfect and the Z axis yeah but yeah I'm still need to increase it so let's give it to 10 and let's see now how it's behave ah got it got it i guess this is also okay we need to play with this x value ah let's see how it's work oh sorry i need to have i i must have a decent speed hmm pretty much looking okay we still need to give some more so at this point let's give it to 10 and now it should be perfect so you know if you it can adjust the value as you want it's totally on you okay so you can basically adjust how you want how you want everything so it's have already ready made everything yes so as you can see it's okay now it's looking totally fine so you can play around with this so that's all in the video nothing else too much you find everything in our description link below so check that or you can use our uh, tech learning uh, learn uh, learn engine app also you can check our discord group okay all the links are description be link below so you can check also for free supports you can join our patreon page so thank you so much for watching guys see you in next real video